Speaker, the backlog of 50,000 veterans' applications is impacting our veterans' mental health. Sanctuary trauma is deeply rooted in a veteran's sense of this government's lack of sacred obligation. December 2018, Shane Jones wrote to the Prime Minister himself documenting ways that he was being treated unfairly by VAC since being medically released in 2008. Yes, his concerns are with current and past governments. The Minister of Veterans Affairs replied personally in June of 2020 to Shane and ordered a departmental review of his file four and a half months ago. When will his review be complete? The Honourable Minister. Thank you very much, Mr. Speaker. And of course, the backlog is totally unacceptable to this government. And that's why, in fact, we invested just under $200 million to make sure we we're able to hire 350 new employees uh, to train them to deal with the backlog. Along with that, Mr. Speaker, we have uh, over 160 uh, other employees who are in training to make sure they deal with the backlog. Along with that, we're uh, digitizing the files and making sure that uh, the people who approve the files are coordinated in appropriate fashion. We have and will address the backlog, Mr. Speaker.